even though I've recently done a tutorial where I updated my current cardboard and weed fabric window covers i had been wanting to replace some of the covers for some of the windows mainly because the ones that I've been using I've actually been using for about a year and whilst they do work I wanted to try something different now I know most car campers will use Reflectix but what I wanted to use was something I saw on a video by the Travel Beans and it's called Life Tree Total Blackout Window Covers. So that is what I'm going to have a go at now and I'm only going to try it on this window first of all so we're going to see how it goes. <laughs> thing I have to do for this video in preparation is measure the size of the windows. Now you've seen me do this in my other blackout cover video but basically all I'm doing is this. I am using a piece of paper and I'm just marking out the size of the window. And my little tip is when doing this if you affix the paper with glue tack to the window then it will save the lactic acid from building up in your arms. What I've ordered should be just enough to do just the back window. It costs, I think, £12.99, so let's have a look. This is pretty much it. I've uh, rolled out a piece of film, and as you can see, it is the perfect size for the back window, literally. And there's actually quite a lot left, to be honest, I'm quite surprised. Okay, so I've adapted this a little bit to suit my own means. But the way this is supposed to work is you spray water and then the plastic will stick to the window. Now what I've done, because I cut it way too large on purpose, basically what I'm now doing is I am putting the fabric in the gaps of the windows. But as you can see, even like that, it's blackout is pretty much total. That is complete and utter blackout. So all I'm going to do now, I'm going to trim up these side bits a little bit, these ends. It's just those ends. And then we'll see how we go from there. But I think this has potential to be really good, actually. That is pretty much it. I've cut round all these sides and put them all into the window frame and it all fits perfectly. Now I've intentionally left a little bit of slack on this side because I don't want it to be a complete fit. You need some room for error in terms of putting this up again. But I think that's really good to be honest. And because it's loose plastic fabric, it'll be very easy to store and I'm pretty sure that is total blackout. The one thing you do need is a spray bottle of water because what you do with this stuff is you spray the water on the windows and then the plastic sticks to the water on the window. I think I've pretty much achieved what I wanted to show you, which was what this Life Tree blackout paper is like. And actually, I think it's quite good. I am going to make some covers for the smaller windows and I'm just doing that now. So I've made up the template and the good thing about these windows is once you've done one template, you've actually done two. And there you go. Well, I actually really like the finish that this has. But as you can see, there is a little bit of light coming out of there. It's not as easy I found fitting it to these windows, mainly because the lips don't appear to be quite as large. 
and I'm very wary of cutting too much off so that it doesn't cover it and already I've already cut I've probably just got a little bit of slack each side a tiny amount of slack so I think at the minute I'll leave it like that and I'll use it like this for the weekend coming up and we'll see how it goes okay well to finish this video off it's now night time the car lights are on so let's go outside and see if there's any light blade so this window has no blackout on then we go to this one and I would say that is 100% blackout the LED light inside is on full blast it's worth noting I do have tinted windows too so that helps and as far as the back is concerned yeah nothing absolutely nothing not a peep of light coming through anywhere and there you go well it's safe to say it passed that test with flying colors so all shall be good for this weekend's car camping. Anyway, on that note, I am off now. So until next time, take care.